What's good, my guys? Back with another video. And this time, I feel like just talking shit. Because woke up today thinking that I had to paint. I didn't. So I tried to go back to sleep. I couldn't. And then I hear Dad cooking in the kitchen. He made chicken. He leaves dips, and I'm over here still trying to sleep. I wake up. I still can smell the chicken. So I'm all like, there's some left. He thought about me. You know the fuck he didn't. He didn't think about me. I was heartbroken. Looked in the pot, nothing. See the grease just sitting there. I was like, oh. Thought about me washing dishes, though. I get it. It's cool. It's all right. It's cool. It's all right. I ain't mad. I ain't mad. Because I made a breakfast burrito earlier. So I'm cool. An egg breakfast burrito earlier. Yes, I know how to cook a little. Petite. Bon appetit. Uh, no, a little French. Don't know that much Spanish, but I know. Petito. No, it's funny. Let me shut up and stop acting like I know other languages when I don't. I only know English, and that's the only fucking language I care about. I don't care about any other language. Kind of. I kind of want to lo learn Spanish. So when I go back to Miami, I'll be like, hey. And then spit some game to some cubanas. No, it's funny. I'm joking. But they is fine out there. The women out there, oh my God. Not one single six out there. They're all tans. All the cars out there is not a bucket. You know, I didn't see one bucket out there. I was like, God dang. No, <laughs> it was crazy. Because <laughs> I was like, man, imagine if my brother drove all the way out here <laughs> with this car. <laughs> this car would be steaming, looking disgusting, looking trash, bummy. Every car out there was a nice car. I and it's crazy because I've only been out there once and I love the city. I loved Miami. But uh, a lot of people got on me about this Cardi B saying she did it for survival. I say, fuck her. It's the reason why she looked like Duck from Land Before Time. I think it's Duck. Yeah, it is Duck, the Land Before Time. No, the one that always goes like, yep, yep, yep. Oh, no, no, no. People be like, she look fine to you? No, no, no. She don't. She look ugly. She hideous. She had to rob people because she wasn't good looking. She had to send transsexuals to rape motherfuckers because she wasn't good looking. And she had to step on people's toes because she wasn't good looking. And then her name, Cardi B. Wonder what the B stands for. Bitch, I don't know, maybe, because she act like one. After I found out about that, I was heated. I was like, oh, she did this to men? Fuck her. Fuck her. That's why she had to settle for an ugly motherfucker like Offset. I said it. Uh-huh. I said it. And then this Kevin Hart, I see that he's at the top. He's not even that foot. He's whack. Movie-wise, he's funny. Stand-up-wise, he's whack. I just gotta say, it. He, he trash. Like, anybody that has the same joke every time going on stage, come on now. You've been in the game for how many years? And you got the same material? Man. Goddamn thunder. You always fucking up my videos. <laughs> Goddamn. Hang on. Yeah, I'm back to it. But yeah, Kevin Hart ain't that funny to me. He's funny in movies, but he ain't funny on stage. He, I say four jokes out of his whole hour set, he gets me to laugh, which is what? Two minutes out of the whole hour means he should only have a two-minute set. That's how wacky he is to me. He doesn't get me to laugh. He gets me to laugh in movies, but he doesn't get me to laugh when he's on stage. Because he always be like, hold up, wait, hold up. Don't make me laugh, hang on. Hold up, motherfucker. 
tell the joke already. How you going to have the crowd laugh when you, like, he just lucky he has a loyal fan base. Because if it was back then, he would be in, he wouldn't get noticed by Richard, Eddie, Bernie, Robin, uh, Whoopi, what's his name, Rodney, all the great comedians out there. Like, times really has changed. I get he fits this era because of how sensitive motherfuckers are. Oh, hang on. Hold up. My dog is annoying me. Yeah, he's not that funny. Another person who I think is funny, though, is Michael Blackson, even though that motherfucker is a little bit on the weird side. He on the weird side. I got to question him because he... I be seeing his shit about the snow bunnies, and then he be with them. Like, even though the snow bunnies that he be getting with is better looking than the black chicks he get. Because I be seeing them black chicks, they got a big ass gap just like him. Like, God damn. The hell wrong with you, Mike? woman he be get like the black woman he be getting is just as fucked up as his feet that's how disgusting they is i be seeing them like i'm like god dang they got booty and then i see the face i'm like oh god she look like his toes get it away no i ain't want it send it away don't want it mm -mm. not me i don't want it I ain't want no woman that looked as fucked up as Michael Blackson's toes. Hell no. But the snow bunny see beginning actually be looking good. I ain't gonna lie. They, they be looking like freaking... I don't know. I can't compare them. Uh, what's her name? Amber Rose. Even though Amber Rose is just thick. I don't know how good looking she is without makeup. Just saying. I seen Cardi B without makeup. Oh my gosh. She look like Duck from Land Before Time. She is hideous. Just hurt us. You ever realize that? Kim Kardashian, I saw a side by side picture of her next to Mewtwo, and they had the same look, body figure. I was like, what the hell did you do to your body? Kim, what the hell? But then again, fuck the Kardashians. I don't give a fuck about that family. They overrated. Even though I would love to get famous off of somebody else. Let me make a goddamn Triple X video. Get famous off of it. Shit. Like, hey, that's me in the video. Yeah, you like that? I piped it down, didn't I? But, I ain't a woman. I can't get famous off of porn videos. Women have it easy. I was going to say that. Besides all the pregnancy stuff and the periods, they have it easy. And the single moms... Besides all that, they have it easy. They can manipulate a man like a motherfucker. They can control a, a man like a motherfucker. I swear they can do everything. They can rule the world. They actually do rule the world. They just do it behind the scenes. Beyonce wasn't lying. Girls rule the world. They'd be like, well... You ain't gonna get me anything. You ain't getting me this. Like, come on now. That's what I wanted. And I gotta do extra. Like, come on. Okay, I'll do extra. Like, I be hating that shit. That's why I stay single. I do. I stay single. In America, I ain't with that shit. I want a woman that ain't about my money. I I need a woman that's about me. And supporting my dreams. I ain't no I don't need a woman that's gonna be like Oh, when are you going to take me out next? Oh, when are you going to spend money on me next? Oh, when are you going to buy me this next? No, I don't want that. I want a woman like, when are you going to cook? Woman, when are you going to cook for me? Oh, right now. Tomorrow's your turn. Cool. If all I have to do is satisfy her with my looks and making her laugh, that's cool. I like that kind of woman. I don't want a woman that's like, Oh, money. You got money. That's nice. Because I realized ever since I had no job, ain't no woman been fucking with me. 
So not cool. Not cool. I should slap the shit out of all of them. <laughs> but I ain't that kind of guy. I'm not that kind of guy. But I feel like doing that. Because the women. Most women. I saw it in the Trevor Noah thing. He said 90% of women. If you take away sex. They have nothing to offer in a relationship. And then 90% of women. If you have no money. They see no reason to be in a relationship. Meaning. Where the hell is the 10% at? I need the 10%. I don't need the 90%. Fuck them. I need me the 10%. I need me a real woman. I don't need no grown little girl that just wants materialistic shit. I need me a real one. It's going to be like, Tim, I just want you to cook for me. And I'll give you all this pussy. I'm like, yes. Cooking. I ain't got I ain't got to order anything, do I? No, just cook. I get to cook. Nice. We have a home-cooked meal. And I don't got to spend shit on you. I like that. I like that. It's nice. Like, my mom even admitted that shit. I was like, you cold-hearted. I can't say the word, but you cold-hearted. Because <laughs> that's my mom. I can't be calling her that. I can't call her that. I almost did. It almost slipped up. But then again, she she has some witch voodoo craft that be going on. She's like, everybody that done me wrong, I get to live to see something bad happen to them. I'm like, oh, hell no. She said, she predicted my brother was going to go to jail. He went to jail. I was like, oh, shit. She was like, this dude is going to get messed up. He got messed up. He got messed up bad. And then... She's always all like, oh, one day my brother's going to get knocked out. He got knocked out. Oh. I forgot what happened, but like she said something about someone over, almost overdosing. And she was like, you see what happens when you do me wrong? I'm like, oh, hell, I ain't doing you wrong at all. I ain't want no voodoo craft doing on me. I'm going to do right by you every time. Because... I don't need that witchcraft on me. No. I'm alright. My mom has that witchcraft. I swear to God she do. She do. That's probably why she go to church so much. Probably why most people go to church. Because they got that goddamn witchcraft going on. And the real devil people. I'm just saying. <laughs> but... Yeah, I just felt like going on a rant today, checking in with y'all, made a video yesterday, make a video today. And as usual, if you're new here, subscribe, hit like, share, do all that. And I'll see y'all in the next video. I'm out.